Nat 20. Welcome back to A Deal with Demons, where in our previous episode, Farron uh, investigated the cave he was in that seemed to be dedicated to some kind of goddess. And he found a small, like, turquoise blue stone that he picked up. And then he decided to, like, try to pray to any god that's nearby, and then he figured out from that which direction to go. So he was on his way out of the cave and was going back towards the path that he saw earlier that goes one way towards Ait and one way through the rest through the mountains going south. And as well, the other crew members uh, they stayed in the miner's lair for a while longer, smoked it out, and then... By that we mean Lazarus sent a, set a fire and we all got smoked out. We didn't yeah. just, like, get high. And then uh, Ryan and Aelrindal, and I guess there are those two, went to the bottom of the lake to see if they could find any treasures. They found a couple... They saw, found the body of the mine player of the Plesiosaurus and found a few shipwrecks which they investigated Ooh. they found a sapphire skull and a few couple of hat couple of hats and blaze and lazarus just uh got um uh, lovecraft. lovecraft and then made their way back to the uh beach we were boring bugcraft no, i'm lovecraft. fishing Nice. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. So I'll start with Blaze and Lazarus right now. Is there anything specifically you're doing while you're waiting for these guys to come back? No. They're I'm wrestling over a pen. <laughs> uh, just roll a survival check to see if you're able to catch any. Twenty-two. Yeah. So you're. Like, from your uh, days in the Feywild and your survival and everything back when you were, like, trained there, you you were proficient in being able to fish and catching anything from the seas or lakes or anything, so you're able to easily catch quite a few fish. Cool. All of them seem to be edible and seem to have quite a lot of meat on them. Uh, I'll pretty much just throw them back in the lake as okay. soon as I catch them. She's fishing for game? <laughs> yeah. I'm not fishing for food. I already, I already had my breakfast. Nice. Uh, is there anything you're doing right now, please? Yeah, uh, Lovecraft and I are doing art. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm having him pose, and I'm gonna paint pictures of him. Like, uh, like I'm having him pose on like his hind legs with his things up, and he's like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. and he's okay. like howling, and I'm gonna paint that. Okay. I uh, just roll a performance check on your painting. And then should Lovecraft also roll performance? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Dope. I could roll for him, it's fine. Um, performance is charisma, right? Yeah. Yes. Do you know what dwarves have for charisma? Uh, probably oh, be like shit, minus all two. Out, right now. Five. <laughs> Fuck all for charisma. Um, they have a minus two. Yeah, he <laughs> yeah. got a four, so uh, everyone so, like, falls down and then wags his tail and like uh, goes back up and faces the wrong way. That's okay, because I rolled that's cute. a that's okay. I 16. Okay. <laughs> So, it might be a little difficult <laughs> to get there, but... Oh my god. Uh, yeah, oh. it takes a while, because Lovecraft isn't, like, the best performing dog. You learning, you learning. But, yeah, he is learning, uh, but you're still able to paint a nice picture of him. Nice. Yeah, that's what matters. Is there anything else you guys are doing at this point? Just waiting for them? Yep. Okay. Uh, I'll go to Farron next. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, hey. Uh, uh, so, you've just left the cave, and you know in your mind where the path you're heading to is. Okay. And the blizzard has subsided mostly. There's still a bit of snow, but you can easily see where you're going. All right, I will, I will follow that sense of direction. Okay. Keeping my eye out for any oopsies and oopsie-daisies. Uh, you start to get lower and lower on the mountain, and then uh, you do see someone walking on the path. It seems to be a larger fellow. Okay. Um. <clears throat> Does he look like a mean fellow? Is he dressed aggressive? Roll a for something. Check. That's uh, not super high. Just in a moment. Why? 
Uh, he's... Yes, let's say a seven. Seven? Yeah. Uh, you're not sure what his alignment would be. You do notice that he's wearing some kind of leather or maybe padded armor or something like that. Okay. Um, and you do see a couple weapons on him. You're able to see a longbow and a spear. That's really all you notice about him. And he does seem like a large fellow. All right, I will put my hands together and just kind of place them on my chest, all nice and peaceful looking, and I will I will approach the man. Uh, as you get closer to him, you, you notice he is a uh, firebolg or furbolg. I never know how to pronounce it. I think it's like furbolg. I believe it's furbugalo. <laughs> and he seems to be around like seven feet tall and like oh and handsome as hell. <laughs> Uh, he has asleep. four screen eyes, gray skin, uh, four screen hair, too. Greetings. Uh, greetings. Hello, my friend. Uh, where are you headed? I'm heading to the city that's just beyond. Ah, that is Ait. Uh, wh- what are you traveling for? Like, Well, uh, you know, I'm kind of lost. I'm, I will admit. Uh, I could all, uh, I'm heading near there, if you'd like to travel with me. The name's Fazmir. Fazmir. Alright, um, my name is Farron. I think you to say, oh, my name is Fazmir. <laughs> <laughs> I am you. <laughs> See, uh, you know, I must say I didn't expect to meet anyone out here in such a blizzard. <coughs> uh, I'm, yeah, I'm, I've actually been on a search for a while. Search for what? For a dragon. A dragon. I heard a dragon when I first approached this area. Do you know what color it was? I didn't yeah. see it with my eyes, but I did hear its noise. What color were its wing beats? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Do you know where it, where it was headed? Not to my knowledge. How would you like to help me kill a dragon? What? And that is where we'll end today's episode. <laughs> yeah. What is it I will <laughs> get in return for helping you slay such a uh, magnificent beast? Oh, oh, <laughs> <laughs> Some experience. I have nothing on me. I own very little that I could give. I would just appreciate the help. Well, you know, you're the only person around here I know for quite a while, so I'll join you. Thank you. I'll help you on your... His course. eyes light up when you say that. Oh. Like, he's super happy. I I appreciate it. This dragon needs to die. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this guy. Very well. We will slay this beast. Thank you, my friend. This dragon had killed pretty much everyone I know. Everyone you know, like a, like a city's worth of people, or just uh, like your brother? <laughs> it, it was a village. It was a village down a bit south and southwest of here uh, that I grew up in my entire life. And this dragon came by one day. It was a black dragon. And it just didn't like what it saw, so it rained hell upon the entire village. I was away at this time, hunting. And no one else... I knew survived. Oh, likely story. I can sympathize with that. I know the feeling of having something you care about ripped from you. Very well, let's go hunting. I suggest you have an idea of where you should be heading. Uh, I... Somewhat. I just believe that the dragon would be to the north. Maybe to the west of Ait. Maybe northwest of Ait. Okay. Well... I'm ready whenever you're ready. Great, great. And he'll kind of lead the way along the path. I will follow. And I'll go back to the guys under the sea, or under the lake. Under the sea. (laughs) Everything's better, down where it's better. Under the sea. So you guys have just investigated this ship. Uh, You found the treasure chest with the sapphire skull intact. Yes. You saw a lot of 
the dead bodies of the crewmates all around it, some on top of the ship. You notice the flag was from Eol. Mm-hmm. Is there anything else you'd like to do? Um... No. We should go check out the other ship. Because how many were more were there? There was one other near one of the other islands that yeah. uh, Zarathos noticed. Go, we should go check out that ship. Maybe it's also from Eol. All right. All right, let's go, Z-Man. Yeah. So you guys make your way to the next ship, and uh, you notice that the flag on this one is of uh, Summer Sail. Mm. Kind of ship I'm interested. It's just a small, like, sailing ship. Okay. And a lake. Yeah, oh, it's, it's a big lake, never mind. Yeah, yeah, it's a big lake and it's just like a sailboat. I don't know, I was just thinking I really like pirates in a lake. <laughs> I don't know. It just makes, it's we like, rule this like Captain lake. Jack Sparrow, he just thinks he's in the ocean or something. Like, oh, we're going to get a bunch of merchant vessels here, laddie. No, like, these aren't big ships at all. You assume that they were just sent here to fight the monsters that were here. So. I know, I just been yeah. goofy. Right. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, well, uh, we'll go... Let's go check it out. So on the front, on the bow, is the bow at the front? I think so. Yeah, in the sure. bow of this ship, you notice that the uh, there's a statue of like a uh, woman like pointing straight forwards as mm-hmm. the front of the ship. Hmm. Uh, you notice the flag of the ship is for summer sail, like I said before. Yeah. Uh, there's again a small crew cabin. This is around the same size of ship as the one you looked at before, like the last one. Uh, you notice that the entire bottom of the hull is just broken and in pieces. So the hull is a hole. It's a hollow hull. Jesus, Tony. <laughs> <laughs> um... And again, you notice a lot of skeletons all around and on top. Nice. Um, yeah, I'm just going to search the ship and see if I okay. can find anything interesting. Ditto. You take the front, I'll take the back. Awesome, that's what we'll do. Okay, so we, Wait, uh, you'll take the back? I'll take the front. Oh, you got it. Okay. Okay, so since you're going to the back, that would be where the like cabin area is. Wait. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think. Yeah, I think yeah. it would be at the yeah, back. Yeah, yeah, sure. And inside, you notice the window's broken again. The door is broken down. You're able to just walk through, and uh, you see that there's a school of fish in here. And as soon as you, as soon as you, uh, no, I guess as soon as you went to the ship, that they would all be flopping on the yeah. ground there. Yeah, pretty it's much. a large school of fish. Nice. Just small ones. What class are they in? Tony, fuck you. <laughs> Class is <missed. laughs> Um, cool. I'm gonna... I don't know. You notice that there's a desk in this room that's, like, for the captain and a few bunks on each side. Uh, you don't see any bones of people in this room. You assume that everyone would have been on deck. Okay. Um, are there any chests? Like, do I see anything around that I can lose? You don't see any chests or anything. Okay, is that... doesn't show up for 15 minutes, you can go home. <laughs> You notice that wow. this, the this inside of this cabin isn't as intricate or as like expensive as the yeah. other two cabins uh, you checked okay. out. Um, I'm gonna check out the desk. Okay. Uh, inside you're able to find like a compass and just uh the torn up piece of of or disintegrated pieces of, of maps and stuff like that. Just okay. any like uh, sailors' tools. Cool. Nothing else. Nothing no. else really, though. No. Cool. I guess I'll, the compass works. Yep. Yeah, I'll take the compass. Um, okay. Now I have two senses of direction. <laughs> nice. Um, Just throw an inside check. Actually, you have three senses okay, of okay. direction now. Nice, man. Mm, that's an eight. Mm. You assume that mm. the crew of this ship probably were just uh, hired to go here. Like, uh-huh. maybe, like, just. Ship, a ship for hire. Ooh. Interesting. Um, I guess if there's nothing else in the room that's noteworthy, I'm going to head back to Ryan. Okay. Uh, I want to check out the figurehead. 
Is she made of metal? Uh, it would be of brass, so yes. Can I take it with me? It would be probably too heavy. Can I take some of it with me? Yes. <laughs> okay. You could, you could uh, probably, like, chop through it, I guess. Maybe. It's a good question. Heat it up and then... Yeah. Have... I mean, I have a whole Smith's kit with me. And a hand axe. <laughs> Don't think a hand axe is going to cut through brass, no. but... Well, I can heat it up first. Yeah, if you heat yeah. it up, you'd yeah, be able to. Yeah, yeah, so I'll cast heat metal, and I'll, um... Do we have a bag of holding with us? No. Blaze right. has it. Well, Blaze should have come with us. You can just make Z-Man carry it. <laughs> uh, Lazarus and I have started playing Patty Cake. Out of boredom. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> don't you have four hands? Can you do it with yourself? No, he only has two hands. Oh. I think. I don't I know. Don't have two hands. I thought you had four. So. I do give one of the fish to uh, Lovecraft, though. Lovecraft's excited about that and just chomps right into it. Sweet. Nice. Okay, yeah. I'll cast ha- heat metal on the sculpture, and I have a hand axe, which I don't really care about that much, so I'm just going to use it to hack away the metal into, you know, carryable chunks. Yeah, you're able to do that, and yeah. you're able to get, I'd, I'd say, like, maybe a quarter, maybe a third of the statue. Okay. Before it be, it's, like, too heavy to take with you. Take the top third. Okay. <laughs> All right. Um, I guess. Why are you doing that? I guess I'll just kind of make my way from the back to the front of the ship and then just keep an eye out for anything. Okay. No, like <clears throat> worth taking or anything interesting. Yeah, you don't notice any other stuff that'd be uh, worth anything on this trip, just because you don't think it was a great crew like you think it was probably the cheapest uh crew yeah, that they, they could have. have and they just got whatever ship they could cool um is there like a rusty short sword that i could take yep do you think it'll give someone tetanus <laughs> oh my god it's possible <laughs> okay I'll, I'll carry it in my hand and carry that uh dead fish in the other yeah. playing the long game are you <laughs> <laughs> well i don't know dude i just I'm just trying to look. Maybe I'll get bird flu. Someone's gonna uh, insult you. Just gonna nick them, and then five yeah. years later, <laughs> yeah. And by now, uh, you'd probably be around halfway to the edge of the lake. Okay. Okay. I'm nice. just chugging along, carrying a fucking third of a mast yeah. head. So okay. after after that, I guess we'll just make our yeah. way out. Yeah. Yeah. Let's get the hell out of here. Okay. Um. And then, are we able to head towards kind of the mainland? Uh, where we were, where we left from shore yeah, before. Yeah. With your new handy dandy compass. And my you're hat. able to. And your hat, yeah, I forgot about the hat, yeah. yeah. <laughs> nice. Um, so you have three yeah. senses of direction now. That's yeah. Yeah. You know, the one we're in, um, yeah. in June from Artemis. And, you know, um, you have the hat and the compass. Yeah. Whoa, I'm the all knowing. You are the <laughs> capital N navigate- navigator. That's me. <laughs> Navigator. Uh, so yeah, you're able to make it to shore mm-hmm. after like killing a bunch of fish from ones that flop in your Yeah. I'm as we go to I'm gonna try to I'm gonna stab some of the fish and I'll I'll I'll, I'll, I'll just like <laughs> 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 I'm just gonna take like, cause I have that like, kind of that big fish, but I'm gonna like take some smaller ones okay. with my hand. Um in order to save room in my hand too, I'm gonna take the fish and put them inside the mouth of the bigger <laughs> fish. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just gonna carry that kind of like a like a a bag like of a fish, fish, a fish bag. Fish bag. Yeah, <laughs> okay. there's, always, there's always a bigger fish. All right. So then, uh, so just enough for that. Maybe everyone can eat. Okay. Sweet. And then, do we just can we just all emerge out of the water? We just emerge out of the water. Like, do they yeah. see us and just like walk out of the? Yeah. Yo, that's like straight out of Pirates of the Caribbean ones. <laughs> oh, I was gonna say Pirates of the Caribbean five. That's also true. Yeah. Yo. All right. <laughs> We've been waiting for six hours! <laughs> we found some cool shit, though. What'd you find? I found a figurehead. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you bring that? Figures. <laughs> <laughs> you, you hear that, um... <laughs> is it... Is it nice. worth anything? No, but it's solid metal. You brought solid fucking metal! Yeah. Come on, like a I'm a forge cleric! Where are you gonna keep it? 
from my bag. I don't know. Hey, we have this cool bag of holding. We also... <laughs> How big is the pieces that you bring? Because the bag of holding only opens um, so far. Well, if they're too big, I can make them smaller. Okay, well, you'll do that. I'll put them in the bag of holding. Sure. What else did you guys find? Yeah. I, I don't know this cool hat. <laughs> I also found this cool hat. <laughs> it gives me a good sense of direction. Did you find any treasures? What I'm saying. I found a hundred bronze pieces. What are bronze pieces? Copper pieces. You just said bronze. bronze oh, sorry, I meant copper. Okay, because I was like, yeah, I don't know yeah. what that is, but I'm just going to play wrong. I was like, okay, he's good. Yeah, um, all right. I found a hundred copper. Oh, that's useful. We can add it to the, the funds. I found a cool locket with a picture of a kid inside of it. <laughs> <laughs> and we found a dagger. And right. do we agree we're going to talk about the skull? We didn't talk about it, but let's not. <laughs> oh. Sounds I could like probably like fixer. determine the value. Mm. So could I. Why would I? Why would I lie? Okay, you don't need to show me. That's fine. I don't see why you're keeping it a secret. I just think it's funny. Okay. <laughs> chaotic good. Okay. Yeah, I'm chaotic neutral. Can I see the dagger? Or can I see the dagger? Oh, examine it. All right, as it. Can I see the dagger at least? I have a big dagger collection, so I'm curious. <laughs> you, what a weird flex. <laughs> I, it's known that I use daggers a lot, I know. so I want to check I'm out surprised you weren't interested by the destination dagger. Uh, too expensive. Yeah. That's All right. right, you can see it, but I want it back. I won't keep it. Okay, I will examine the dagger, too. <laughs> I they, 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 didn't, they, they learned thing. everything about it. Right? <laughs> yeah. yeah, so yeah. I just, I just character checking it out. Yeah, yeah. I'll give it back. Well, if you ever feel like not having it, throw it my way. And gently. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Um, Is that an offer? Like... Okay. No. Okay. Did we <laughs> legitimately find anything else besides that stuff? That's all you found, stuff. really? Found yeah. Like you didn't find anything uh, else. I found this compass, which also tells me which direction <laughs> I'm pointing. Holy <laughs> shit! No way! But I mean, <laughs> large plesiosaurus, Steve. Is that everything oh, you oh, found? Oh, uh, Z-Man, grab your dagger. Your <laughs> yeah. dirt. Thank you. Uh, uh, Z-Man, look at you. I will your take my stuff. daggers back with you. Uh, I was also missing three arrows. <laughs> Look at we didn't, <laughs> <now. laughs> we didn't buy <laughs> any arrows. You lied, sack of shit! <laughs> no, it's fine. No, uh, but seriously, you didn't find any cool treasures. Uh, it's the bottom of the lake. We also got the uh, uh, Pleosaurus teeth. We yeah. grabbed about twenty. That's not what I'm talking about. You <laughs> can I roll an insight? See if they're lying to me. If they're lying. Oh, uh, sure. Well, technically, if we find anything else cool, and if we don't really count the skull as cool, like we didn't <laughs> really, it's not really lying. We we're rolling deception. Yeah, yeah. What are you shooting? Yeah, good thing my deception is so good. What'd you roll? Actually, my deception is so good. It'll be a sixteen. <laughs> oh, minus one, eighteen. Oh, yeah. but, but it still beats. Okay, yeah. I don't believe uh, they're yeah. lying. I'm good. Fuck. Um, <laughs> All right, good work, you guys. Can we please fucking leave? <laughs> Yes. Good. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Who are we going to? Eight. 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 So, eight. eight. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Um. After that, we should definitely head towards Eel. That's where Artemis is going. How do you know that? You know that Artemis is in Shun, or yeah, well, last time you said. But do you assume that he'd probably yeah. be going to Eel next? So. I know he's in Shun, but I. I expect he's going to be heading to you. I grew up in that town. <laughs> we'll do a lot. So you guys are right here. And Ida's here. Oh shit, we're, we're so We're not going to Chun! We have to go to Ida! I, I want to get back to normal! Yeah, let's go to Ida. I can't on, stand so. being this fucking squirrely piece of shit anymore! <laughs> All right, we should make haste. You're not, you're not gonna find me on it, no. sweet. <laughs> I said, I said, let's go to, let's go to Chum. I eat first. No, I said oh, let's go to eat first, oh, but then let's oh, go to let's, oh. like, let's, let's hurry because Arnis is just gonna keep fucking shit up. Trust. Plus, that's where Farrell thinks we're going, anyways. I, if we're gonna find him, it'll be there. <laughs> I'm sure. If, I'm sure Farrell will be fine on his own. I don't know, that guy seems fucking dodgy, man. Blizzard transition. <laughs> Listen, you... what, let's just fucking, god damn, I'm so... Who fucking cares? <laughs> I'm so exhausted. <laughs> I've thrown up like a record amount of times. My fucking throat is so sore from screaming. I got, 
My brain literally beat up by a fucking squid. <laughs> I had to fight a dinosaur. I hate swimming. I just want to lay down and cry. Can you please, oh my God. Can you please stop talking? <laughs> I'm sorry. You think I looked at it like this? Oh my God. And just shut up. Have you been caught by a fucking dragon? <laughs> I'm just going to run over the cart. And just like slap my face into it. And just go to sleep. <laughs> All, right. All right. Hey, did we do an arcana check on the skull? You did not. Mm, I don't think we did. Literally... I don't know why you're keeping this secret from me. I could be so helpful, but that's fine. Mm-hmm. Maybe. Do we just do we just exchange looks? <laughs> do I know he's talking about the skull? Roll insight. Ooh. Ten. Uh, you think you're on the same page? All right. I, I'll walk over quickly to. I will s- stealthily walk over. Or casually. I will casually. <laughs> That's the best word I can pick. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> I speak often. Um, I'm going to casually for a walk Shit. over to Ryan. And um, I'm going to kind of like whisper and be like, You think I'm thinking? <laughs> I think I'm thinking what you're thinking. <laughs> I think I'm thinking what you're thinking, what you're thinking. <laughs> I'm thinking I wish you had to eat. And the head gone. Can we please fucking go? Head <laughs> head onto the carousel. Um, <laughs> do you want to check the skull? I think. It's not my voice. What? <laughs> You're Scottish, not Batman. <laughs> Scottish Batman. <laughs> Scottish Batman. Scottish Batman. <laughs> Where's Rachel? <laughs> I think we should. Okay, uh, <laughs> yeah, so I'll, just roll in our can of chat. I have to roll shitty and you get desperate and come to me. Natural 20. Oh, you fucking me! I'm not even gonna bother. Woo! Rolling our kind in history is the whole point of place! <laughs> so, you know, this has a cantrip infused in it, and it is dan- Dancing Lights cantrip. Oh, sweet. Oh, so that's it. And you know that the lights will come all out of its eyes and nose and mouth. We literally have a party skull. <laughs> you found a disco ball shaped like a skeleton. Yo. Party skull! <laughs> Rock on! <laughs> And, and you know you just have to boop the nose for it. Oh my god. Yeah. We're losing daylight, guys! Come on! Alright. Boop So I'm, I'm assuming you exchange this information with me. Yes. Nice. I say, hell yeah. Here. Touch it, touch it, snoop. <laughs> boop the snoop. <laughs> I put my fingers in the, in the snoop. Okay, you boop it and uh, lights just come dancing out. Do I notice what are those? <laughs> <laughs> do, I, do I notice that? Yeah, do we notice that? Uh, roll a... Wait, what's your passive perception? Well, no, it's, it, it's like late yeah. after you. Oh, okay. so, they, so the light wouldn't be so noticeable. Like, there wasn't a bright shining. What's your passive perception? The is dancing. I would say 14. 14? 14, 14? You guys noticed it. Hey, what's that? <laughs> I don't know. It just came out of nowhere. <laughs> Can't <Inside> I check? <laughs> Can we hide it? And Stop can, playing I, I, I around. Let's lights. go. Oh yeah, you do. Okay, I rolled a sixteen in such. Well, did they 16. see the skull or did they see just the lights? The lights. Yeah, you just see the lights going past them. I, I whisper to Ryan and say, "Quick, put the skull back." I put the skull back. Okay, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna cast dancing lights. Before you say, <laughs> oh my <laughs> god! I'm gonna perform it on the compass. Okay. Nice. You didn't say that compass can fucking go. <laughs> you said it pointed where you pointed. I don't know I did this. I'm fucking a- God! I'm afraid. <laughs> <laughs> Can we please go? Yeah, Man, I'm smooth. fucking shit. That was good. <laughs> Alright. Totally pointless. Uh, I'm gonna snoot again. Tell Yo, me. please, God, can we go? Yeah, the snoot again and it turns off. Okay, sweet. Um, I say to Blaze, I'm like, do you want the compass? Sure. Alright. Uh, <laughs> I'll be... Do you, can I deactivate dancing lights? Yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to deactivate it, act like I I did something to the compass. I'm going to give it to you. <laughs> <laughs> do a quick arcana check without touching it. I'm going to do a quick arcana check. Magic seemed to be coming from it. <laughs> I take the fucking compass <laughs> and I put it in the bag of holding it. And then I'm like, Hi! Get out of the fucking car! <laughs> <laughs> 
And then I'm gonna drive to work because I'm gonna go to hike because I'm so okay. sick of this shit. Okay, <laughs> I'll go back to Farron and Fazmir. Oh my god. Uh, so oh. you're traveling north towards Ait. Oh, uh, you assume you're is, right uh, now. You're uh, when you ask uh, Fazmir like about where you're at and stuff like that, he tells you that you'd be be about halfway between Ait and uh, Deepwater Lake, and it'll be probably like a two day hike to Ait. Okay. Okay. Uh, and he'll he'll just like start talking to you about your travels and stuff like that. Like, ask where you came from, uh, where you've been, where you're going to go. Where you come from. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, where you oh. come from, where you go, where you go, where you go in Cotton Eye Joe. <laughs> is that what he says? No. Okay. <laughs> but he is just asking, like, where, you, where you've been and stuff like that. I've... And how you came, like, uh, how you were on the mountain before. I wanted to hike a tall mountain, preferably. I, my life was not very exciting before this moment. I was looking for adventure, and the mountains seemed like the right place to begin. Did you find anything up there? No. No? No, just snow. It's really Why disappointing. Uh, however, I did find a cave. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, wait, I found that's it, not it, a place. That's where the adventure began. Oh, really? Uh, it, there was a uh, one room had a shrine of a lady. Uh, there were paintings, uh, or like yeah, paintings on the walls of battle between some men under her control and uh, demons. There was the symbol of Hephaestus on the weapons. Uh, that that painting was just as of her against all the demons. She oh, didn't have an army with oh, her. Okay, okay. Yeah. What a tank! <laughs> yeah, and you'll say. Do you, uh, do you know anything about, like, who that goddess person was? I have no idea, to my knowledge, who that lady was. Do you have an, any ideas about any of the, of any symbolism or anything up there? I know the weapons she was using were crafted by Hephaestus. Hmm. Um, there were some other symbols in one of the rooms of uh, a mountain. Uh, one was a symbol of water, and I think the other one was fire. Interesting. The other room contained a bunch of statues of what looked like to be important people. They had their hands out, they were holding weapons in the other one. And there was a statue in the middle, with a, or a painting in the middle with a fountain. Uh, what, what was the painting of? Uh, it, was, it was of that same lady. Okay. Never heard of anything like this. Like, the only thing I know of is, I've heard of Hevestus a few times. You see, from what I know, he's one of the oldest gods. Uh, did any of the other statues seem to be seem to be like of any gods of any kind? I don't think I picked up on that. Uh, yeah, you weren't exactly sure. They seemed powerful, but you're not sure if they were gods, demigods, or just regular people. But well, they seemed powerful. All those statues, they seemed very important, as if they were powerful people. But I'm not sure. Who they represented. Were you able to determine like how long the statues or the painting had been there for? To my knowledge, either ten years or a thousand years. I think it was more of a thousand years. Mm-hmm. No, you don't. You rolled a really shitty history check. Well, that you was knew that the co- there was oh, a coin right, that was right. almost a yeah. thousand years old. Okay, never mind. Sorry, <laughs> that's before that. Interesting. Uh, might have to go check that out myself sometime. Oh, um, I don't know if you'll know much about this, but I found these coins. I'm going to pull up the really old coins. Okay. Uh, do these, do you know anything about them? Uh, he looks at them and, uh, uh, he's not exactly sure. They, he just tells you they, they seem real, some of them, them seem really old to me. I've never seen, uh, any of these before. They seem like past my time. They're created. Mm, very well. Well, with a shot, uh, I'll put them back in my pouch. So, uh, two days, huh? Yeah, it should be around two days. Two eyes, anyway. 
if I my legs get tired, can I just crawl on your back? I I could carry you for a while if you need be. Okay, good. I don't I don't need it yet, but I I might. I mean, I have tiny legs compared to your legs. I have to walk twice as fast to keep up. Would you prefer I walk slower for you? No, no, we would get there slower. That's not needed. No, thank you. So you've just been traveling alone all this time. Yes. I just came from a small village. Uh, and it was very boring there. So I went to seek adventure. So I left. Everyone hated me for leaving because I just kind of abandoned them in the work. Um, and then I found this mountain and I thought, well, what better way to start an adventure than uh, climbing a mountain? Now look, about to go slay a dragon. You haven't by a chance ran into a dwarf with like colorful or color changing hair, have you? I believe I have, haven't I? Yeah, yes. beast neck. Um, why do you ask? Uh, he was a traveling companion and a good friend of mine for a while until he uh, needed to go to Silsby to rest. Can I insight to see if he's... He seems to be telling the truth. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Lie in your... <laughs> he's a good dude, you're not. Um, yeah, I've had some encounters with him. Uh, do you know how he's doing or, like, where he is? He seems to be doing very well. Uh, he helped us find the... the... Sorry. He helped me find the depths. You went to the depths. I just wanted to see what it looked like. I got too scared, so I left. Such a fucking liar. <laughs> but uh, he the, did show me where they were. The depths is a dangerous place. I know, that's why I didn't go in there. I heard screams and I was like, nope, sorry. That's a good choice. <sighs> but uh, he's doing well, last I checked. Uh, do I know where he went after that? Uh, Beastnack, uh, he went, he uh, helped bring the ch- child demon... Yeah. Uh, Dragonborn back to Stillsby. Right. Um, last I heard, he went off to Stillsby. Well, that's good. I'm glad he's all right. I'm sure he's probably just drinking in a tavern and having a good time. There is another opening to the depths around here, too. That I found a while back. Really? Yes. Where would that be in particular? It's... Uh, past the mountain you came from, on the, like in the next mountain. Okay. Uh, not too far off. It's probably a day's march from here. Day's march from the mountain that I came from. Yes. All right. Okay. Well, it's a terrible place. I would not recommend going there. Nor would I. Nor will I ever go there. Um, but it's good to know where these entrances are, so I can stay far away from them. Yes. <sighs> kind of cold. <laughs> <laughs> no uh, I have an uh, extra pelt you could put on if you need it. I would love an extra pelt. If you pelt. just hand you like a, a bear pelt. Oh yeah, we're gonna look so cool. A onesie. <laughs> I'm just gonna toss that around my shoulders okay. there. Oh, yeah, now I look like Buff Farron. This is a sick bromance. Y'all got going on. I'm upgrading the ass mask and you're a fucking bear outfit. Yeah. <laughs> is there a reason for the mask? Uh, it helps me breathe. I have a bad um, cough. Lung system going on right now. I am dying. That's why these tubes go, they go into uh, my throat. Uh, I see. They provide me air. <laughs> right into my larynx. <laughs> and I'll go back to you guys right now. Alright. So you guys are headed off now? Yep. Yes, sir. I am driving the car to Ike. We're going I, to Ike. I sit near the sure exit again. Drive. I fucking... Dude, I rolled great the other time. Okay? I sit near I the one exit. bad roll. Back <laughs> off. Another uh, bad roll. Just roll another animal handling check. You know what? I'm gonna fuck rush this animal handling check. <laughs> you can get like a one. Okay, yellow, green, or blue? Blue. Twelve. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you're moderately able to keep the horse on track. <laughs> you go f- over. You, you do go over a few bumps that like jolt everyone up and wake everyone up who was sleeping in the back of the cart. That's what you get for making me wait six fucking hours on a shore. <laughs> We're getting every bottle on the way there, baby. 
You know, I'm in the car with you. <laughs> I know, collateral damage, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and you do know that there was a cave that you visited about ten years ago while you while on in your monk training in the mountains. Oh, really? <laughs> uh, that caved in, like, uh, just a few minutes after you entered, and you weren't able to explore more of it. Mm. And do you remember this painting, where there's painting on the walls of this, like, goddess-like woman? Oh, doesn't sound important. <laughs> <laughs> that just comes to mind all of a sudden? Uh, well, because you're traveling in that direction, you kind of think back about it. And activated. Oh. Remember the good times. You guys want to... Check it out sometime, maybe after we're done tonight. Yeah, so, well, what, 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 what are you talking about? I, I relay that thought. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm not hiding it. <laughs> no, I'm not interested. I've learned that honesty is key for a good group. You don't want to lie to your fucking friends. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but uh, <laughs> yeah. So maybe after we're done all this hype business, we could, or maybe after the Shardana, we could go check it out. You know, maybe we could learn something cool. Visit a random cave that's caved in on the top of the mountain. <laughs> There's always another way in. That sounds very fun. <laughs> There's always. That was just a suggestion! Okay, it came to mind. Fuck! Yeah. And you know it's like on the way to ice as well. Is it? It's yeah. literally... It's on the way! <laughs> I'm not interested. <clears throat> okay, we will go. Interested. Fine, we will go. But uh, I'm going to leave the cart there anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just not going to tell them we're headed there. Okay. Farron, he's probably far gone. So I'm going to secretly <laughs> drive the car to the cave. He's probably okay. lying through his teeth wherever he is. <laughs> He's probably okay. No! <laughs> uh, so you guys travel for a while north, and eventually you are in the mountains. So the hills rise up into mountains, and you do notice it starts to get a bit colder. You do start to raise in uh, altitude. Uh, you notice snow on some of the peaks now. Uh... And you're starting to see less and less wildlife as you travel. Oops, did I make a wrong turn? Whoa, silly blaze! <laughs> <laughs> and this is, uh, like, the main path to Ike. Oh. And because of how cold it is, you don't really run into any other people traveling this way. And do you know, since you've been in Ike before, and around Ike, because that's part of your monk train, that... Not a lot of people go to Ide, but Ide is a like decent sized city that's for everyone who lives in the area. Yeah. Okay, but well, yeah, I'm gonna lead us to the cave I mentioned. Okay, so that will be about a day away. What? Are you just like it is there? on the path though? Like uh, you go yeah. on the path and then you just go just west up a mountain a bit, the exact way that Farron yeah. went. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna <laughs> go that like way. following the trail. It it is the same. Dory guys will be in in no time! <laughs> Do I notice that he's... Like, would I know... I have a map of Telfania. Yeah, you, uh, so you wouldn't notice it yet, because you're still on the main path yeah. to... Yeah, okay, I we'll get to that, like, <laughs> yeah. that split. Okay. Yeah. Um, while we're <laughs> driving, can I just attune to my double-sided longsword? Yes, of course. Yeah. Sick. Yo. I thought you were going to say just turn on some tunes. <laughs> Let's turn on some tunes, please. <laughs> what song is playing? Alright. Okay. How long does it take to attune? Uh, I think it's too. Sh- uh, Clayton was saying it was too short rest. Sure, so okay. I'm not exactly sure. But I believe it's say too. Sh- that. Uh, I can make a long rest. It's a two minute, right? Yeah. Just uh, you have to like actively do it though, right? Yeah, it's too short yeah. rest. Yeah, you have to use it. It's not long, long at all, though. Yeah. No. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Just start like stabbing into the card and stuff. I'll just, start swinging I'll just around. throw it <laughs> and then and see if it comes back. Helicopter it? Yeah. Yeah, I'll find it. Or Darth Maul? I actually oh, cut one of those in half. The thing I learned two minutes, I think, oh. is actually oh, no. uh, no, no, a DM guide. Better than the other. I believe it's two minutes. I'm not fucked up. So you do kind, you two kind of have opposite weapons right now because you have one you can throw and bring back to your hand, oh, and yeah. then Tony has one you can throw and go to the weapon. And mine's really, really big, and his is really, really tiny. Yeah, yeah. I'm like the fourth Hokage, though. <laughs> <laughs> no kidding. I know what it is. I don't know who the fourth one is though. Isn't that Naruto's dad? Is that right? Clayton is not Minato? Isn't he the fifth one? Mina- Minato is the fourth Hokage. Okay. Naruto's father. Yes, I was correct. Anyway, 
Did wow. he find anything about achievement? Wow. Wait, what's it? Dude, I'm not nerd, trust me. <laughs> I want to be linked to Kogi. <laughs> <laughs> it's my ninja, my ninja way! Don't make fun of Naruto. What a big dummy. Why did the DNA say that DM guy? So I'm just gonna go okay. really quick. I'm just gonna go over it. Don't worry about it. Uh. Uh, I, I'd say oh, yeah. you would be able to attune to it on your on the travel okay. that way, since you're not really doing anything else. No. Woohoo! Ooh. Is there anything oh. else specific? One short rest. One short One rest. One full short rest. You, have, you okay. can't do anything else during that short rest. You have to be focused on the item. Uh, is there anything you guys specifically want to do while you're traveling? Okay. Wow! I'm gonna check out that compass. You're an archive. You're driving. Yeah, I'm driving a cart. <laughs> Yeah, so you check it out and do an arcane check and you detect no magic coming from it. Fucking liars. Alright, <laughs> so now I know they've been lying to me. Alright. Suspicion grows. Uh, <laughs> but I don't act on it just yet. It's like a hill and two mountains and a hill. I'm walking with Fazmir. I want to study the, the stone I have. So I'm going to pull it out and okay. mingle with it. Uh, first, while you guys are traveling, is there anything you want to do before you go back to I'm throw my longsword at a tree. Okay. And try and get it to stick in. Why? Yeah, uh, just roll, roll to it. If you can't attune to it quick enough, you just lost. And is that dex or strength? It would be a dex. Down yeah, down. for throw. And I don't even get proficiency. No, you, can still proficiency. Use, you can still use strength. <clears throat> is it? Where if is it's it? a finesse. Because hand oh. axes use strength for throwing. Mm-hmm. And javelins as well. Okay, sure. Okay, well, I'll allow that. I'll allow it. You love it? I'll uh, use this one ideally. You, you don't hit the tree you were aiming yeah, for, but you hit the one beside it. Sweet. And it sticks in. Alright. And the curtain keeps going. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's fine. I just leave it there. Once he's <laughs> gonna be like in the city and he's gonna call for it. Like, <laughs> is there a range to it? Or is it just like, is it like Thor where you can just like call it from anywhere? That would be very cool. That'd be so good. Uh, there should be, a, there is a 250 foot range. Okay. That's very a good Zareth those kind of looks at you like, what are what are you that's your <laughs> I, I just I look at him and I shrug like I don't care and then I just go and sit in the front of the car <laughs> <laughs> hey what's up hey man how's it going hey hey so uh and then hey, very well, quietly under my breath I say the word okay and Zerthos does not notice it by bad sweet Bye. and then he's just talking to you guy, uh, you and Lazarus and being like did you see what he just did just threw out a perfectly good weapon Threw hey, right into a tree and just left it there. I wouldn't worry about it. <laughs> hey, how much worry problem. about Why don't you worry about your own shit? You know he's a bastard. <laughs> <laughs> so does it actually like fly back to you or does it just appear in my head? Uh, it flies back to you. Flies back, yeah, does it nail? Awesome. Awesome. Is it yeah. nail? <laughs> no. I was gonna uh, just kill it. <laughs> <laughs> you grab it back and let me just like hang it off of it. Um, <laughs> hey, uh, quick question here, Ryan. Uh, why'd you fucking lie to me? <laughs> Uh, what? This compass is not magical! Oh yeah, we were just fucking with you. Sorry. Um, Do I hear them talking about this? Hey, Elrond, I just passed that like, cantrip. So we were just messing with you, I'm sorry. It was funny, though. Uh, oh, wow! <laughs> yeah, that's a 17. Yeah, you hear them talking Yeah, about. I say, sorry, boys. We just thought it'd be kind of funny. And it was. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> that a one? That was a seven, so okay. nine. I believe you! <laughs> You're my best friends! <laughs> Good times. I should probably be honest. We're not going to hide. I'm probably... What? <laughs> <laughs> friends don't lie. You're right. I thought you were lying to me, so I lied to you. But you weren't lying, so I'm going to be honest. We're going to a cave, I mentioned. We straight up lied. We yes, said, but I didn't know. But also, was. why? Because I want to go! Yo, we really go to, we should go to I, and then we need to really head towards you. Listen, man. This is a matter of time. I don't have a lot of time. <laughs> Please. <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to die one day. <laughs> I thought you were going to try to chew me out and like a blade. <laughs> I don't have a lot of time. Oh, should I forget to change my time? <laughs> Please. <laughs> you know what? I kind of agree with him. But we can learn really good information there. How about this? We we drop you off of this cave and we keep going. 
That fucking killed me. Sometimes I think you guys don't have my interest at all. Sometimes I'm gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> Let it go! Let it go, man. Don't worry about it. Yeah, let, let this cave go. We'll, we'll never do anything I want. That's fine. Let Whatever. it go. <laughs> let it go. <laughs> fine. We won't go to the fucking cave. I'm actually kind of into See? More than one of us wants to go. Hey, Z-Man, you want to go to a cave Dude. that has ancient gods depicted on the walls? Celestial? You're a fucking bard. You should love this stuff. <laughs> yeah, it could have... It- could have something maybe to do with the master or exactly. other important, like Fine. other stuff. We'll like leave you guys here with one horse. Oh no! <laughs> we'll leave you with a horse, and you can carry a knight. Since there's gonna be more of us, we should get the cart. I'm gonna persuade him if I can. I'm not a huge fan of oh, inter party persuasion. Damn it! <laughs> Please! I support that. That's fair. <clears throat> Please! <laughs> um, I want you. To be my president. <laughs> I don't know. Right, I'll be nice. with you at whatever you want me to be. <laughs> okay. Boys. I'll spread to a vote. If you want to go to the cave, say I. Zerithos so says, wait, to I? No, to the cave. Oh. Yeah, Zerithos so says I. 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 <laughs> uh, Lovecraft goes, oh. <laughs> Whoa. Please roll for Lovecraft. No. Keith's gonna go where I go. Yeah, he would go where he, where he goes. No, Damn. no, I, I gave him some fish earlier. So? <laughs> Maybe this is a Minecraft. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Listen to me, please. We really. <laughs> we really need to go to I could find something to help me get back to normal there, maybe. I don't know about that. They said the wizard was in the mountains. I thought it was a knight. What, what, in the mountains knight? near age. Oh. I'm not giving up my chance, man. You can't ask me to do that. If you don't want to come, you can take a horse, you can leave. I'm fine with the way you are now. I'm not! (laughs) You're perfect. I'm not perfect! (laughs) I'm not a piece of shit! I look like some old man (laughs) stern! My head is gone! There's just a mouth that talks! We'll leave you the cart and we'll take the horses. That's... <laughs> cool. Uh, you're outvoted. Just hook up <laughs> Lovecraft. <laughs> you, you and Lovecraft <laughs> can pull the card. What's going on here? <laughs> Dude, I don't know. This is this whole thing has gone derailed. Um, how is your? It's on the way to Ike, the cave. I remember. Is the cave really off track? By chance, any faster going to Ike? <laughs> yes. <laughs> is he lying? He doesn't like inner party. <laughs> yeah. no, I know he's lying. Roll a inside check. I'm all yeah. that too. Sure, it's so hard for them to yeah, decide something. <laughs> sure, no. Like I, I'm good for rolling for deception and like stuff like that. Seventeen. I got a 14. The die is gone. Oh, and then you right add there. our rolls together. Right? <laughs> 16. You got 17? You got a 17. I got, I got a 14. 14. Yeah, you're pretty free as line. <laughs> I know this place. No, you it's don't. It's not going to be faster. Fuck do you know? I pull my map and like, based on all these distances, <laughs> Shit. it's not going to be faster. Fuck, defeated by cold hard logic. <laughs> Listen, we're going to the fucking cave! I thought you said you don't lie to friends. <laughs> Am I your friend? <laughs> Not anymore! You want me to stay a fucking rannequin? I don't want to be a rannequin! It's not that. You think it's it feels just... good to be something you're not? You're an abyssal rat, not Trust a me. Oh, I know that more right, than sorry. anyone. I've been saying rannequin for so yeah. long. <laughs> I just realized that. Yeah. He's what? He's an abyssal rat, not a rannequin. Oh. It's a similar thing, I think. Yeah. Still, I'm an abyssal wretch! And this wizard's supposed to be in some random cave that you had a dream about? I didn't have a dream, I was there! <laughs> Asshole! <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> the point is, he's in the mountains. This cave I know that is littered with celestial writings is in the mountains. There's gotta be a connection. I could really use this. <laughs> man, I can't keep living like this, man! That doesn't affect me. <laughs> uh... 
I feel some compassion for Blaze. I ship him. <laughs> listen. I, I feel pain listen, for you. Listen, if you do this for me, then I will be 100% behind you for the rest until we find those fucking Jordanas, okay? I'll use my mouth hand to suck your dick. <laughs> <laughs> I will not! I will not suck your dick with my love Listen, you do this for me. Cut this. And that's the end! If you do this for me, I, I'll be on your team, man. I'll hold oh, away. Shit. We're gonna go to the show down, and nothing will stop us after this. Please. Please! Uh, we're already on our way to the cave, right? Uh, uh, you're on your, your way to light? But there's just and like, it'll be a small detour to go to the cave. It's barely a detour! Oh, do we know how long of a detour approximately be? Uh, Blaze, you're pretty sure that you were able to get up to the cave in around an hour, maybe two hours? See, we won't even lose daylight over it. Fine, but we need to keep it short. There might be a really powerful monster in there. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> do I remember anything about monsters in the mountains? Uh, you don't remember seeing any monsters, monsters in that cave. No, but do I know of any Bear creatures no. in the mountains? Yeah, itself? you you'd, you would probably have remembered seeing a yeti or two, a dragon maybe fly past. There could be all sorts of bounties up there for you. I'm talking, I'm talking Dude, some good old yeti. They come yellow. They come, no, it's not yellow. Sorry, they come white, blue colors. Uh, there's a dragon, probably. I think. I think I saw one. It could, could be a wyvern, but I think it was a dragon. So we'll take even more time out of our day to go hunt a monster. Like you don't want to hunt the monster. I'll give you half an hour at the cave. All I need is 45 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm staying with the cart. If you're not out in half an hour, I'm leaving. Okay, but here's the deal. You stay with the cart. I'll take the horses. <laughs> Into the cave. Yeah, good idea. <laughs> yeah, well, I can't. I okay, can we please go to the cave? Is that a, is that a oh thing? God. Yes, we're going to the cave. Thank you. I appreciate it. That's it. Thank you. Conversation Thank over. Thank you so much. Okay, uh, back to Farron. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, that was exhausting. <laughs> so you run running to, like, Try check out the stones. Yeah, right? just as we're walking, minutes. I'm just going to inspect the stones, see if I can learn anything about it. What? Yeah. Uh, again, you do notice magic coming from it. Uh, if you will ask, what's up with that stone? Oh, I Did found Did you find it. that? There I, I found it, yeah, in the cave I was telling you about earlier. It was, uh, it was there, uh, and I took it. It was on one of the statues. Is it just a normal stone, or do you know if there's something going on with it? I mean, as far as I know, there's a bit of magical property, but I'm trying to figure out what that is at the moment. I could try to help. I could cast a spell to you, figure it out. All right. I'll give it a shot. I'll hand the I'll hand stone over to him. Okay, and he'll cast Detect Magic on it. What a guy. What a guy. And he notices that it is a kind of uh, transportation magic. Ooh, time for me to get my ass back home in my place that in the my cave that makes me sense feel good feel only good things. <laughs> and you'll say it, it most likely ties to a specific area. Mm, okay, so stone ties to a specific area and it has something to do with transportation. Yes. Okay. Well, that's better than nothing. Um, oh yeah, I'll take the stone back. Do you want to try it out? See where you went up. How do I try it out? Yeah, it, it's a it's a risk because you never know where you might appear. Now, aren't we kind of hunting a dragon? We are. Yes. I just use this now, bippity bop. I'm not here to help you fight that dragon. I appreciate that. <sighs> no, hold on to it for now. I'll try it later. Have you guys both teleport and then just like close your eyes and cross your fingers and imagine you're gonna teleport to the dragon? Maybe you will. No. Just said it was probably fixated to one place. Yeah. The and, dragons. Uh, the dragon's lair. It could yeah. probably transport more than one person too. Okay. Well, it's one of well, those, another one of those Shardana stone things. 
I'm taking the chips again. Oh, yeah. I'm really holding on to this anyways. I mean, I'm up there. <laughs> You're not here. You're not here. Thank you for the information. No problem. Glad we could talk about. Um, so, about you. Yes. What are you exactly? Some sort of brave warrior or a soldier? Uh, well, back in my village, I was one of our main hunters. Just hunting for any animals and for food, stuff like that. Foraging as well. Foraging. Uh, I learned... Uh, some druidic magic while I was growing up as well. Wow. So I can transform in, I can transform into other beasts and stuff like that. Transform into a horse? <laughs> <laughs> I could. I could. Ah, oh, yes, degrading. <laughs> <laughs> Not saying you have to, but, you know, it would, it would speed up the process. We will get to where we're going faster. I mean... Hey. <laughs> <laughs> or perhaps a really big bird. Like a... Like a, rock. a pigeon. <laughs> I don't... I probably would not be able to transform into a large bird, I don't think. That's fine. That's why I ask questions. I, uh, I guess I could transform into a horse. I... It's kind of degrading, but I guess I could. <laughs> no, that's fine. I don't need you to transform okay. into a horse. I was just curious. Yes. No need to degrade you. However, <laughs> <laughs> let's keep up a pace. Yeah, sorry. It's just getting colder and colder, and I'm yeah. very much sick of all this snow. Have you ever been to Ike before? No, I can't say that I have. It's a great city. Uh, great people, lots of shops. What makes it so great? Uh, just, just welcoming, and uh, I've never felt like uh, feared or like discriminated there. Lots of things to do. Do you think it's possible that the dragon's heading that direction? Uh, I believe that this dragon may have a lair somewhere in the mountains around Eich. I'm not sure exactly where. At first I thought it was to the northeast, northwest of the city, but I'm not entirely sure anymore. All right. Um, oh, can I listen to my... Because you said I had senses that were telling me to go two different directions. Yeah. Does one of them lead me this way? Uh, let see. What was I thinking, thinking when I said that? Uh... <laughs> Yeah, the one is leading to Eich, you assume. Okay. And the other one is fading a bit, but it seems to be somewhat in the direction that he came from. Okay. Like, past the mountain. Okay, cool. <clears throat> All right, I'll, yeah, I will still continue walking with the good old Fazmir. In silence. <laughs> Sweet, sweet silence. And that's where we leave off on this episode of The Deal with Demons. Woo! Can we get a subway? <laughs> okay.